What's going on y'all, Bricks from Bricks Fitness. We are about to leave DC. We're heading up to Philly for stop two on the tour, a beautiful day tour with my man Rob Hill Sr. Um, eventful morning, got a lot of work done. Had to hustle and get that vlog that I posted yesterday done. But anyway, we're about to hit the road. I need to go pick up Rob and then we're heading up to Philly. We just got to Philly. It took three and a half hours. That's not that bad. It took three and a half hours. It's five, five oh six. The event starts at six. So we're heading straight to the venue now. I need to eat my tuna sandwiches. And uh, I'm looking forward to another successful event where you reach some, some folks. Get some people thinking, and I could learn some more. You better get it in before Rob. This Rob eats all of it. <laughs> yeah, He'd be on it, right? I'd be like, oh, can I? Oh, it's gone. Getting dressed. We gotta get in 20 minutes. Huh? I'm I'm telling them what we're doing. Oh, yeah. We got, yeah, we got about 20 minutes to eat, get dressed, and pee. So we, we've learned, because we're getting better at this packing food on the road thing. You want the quick stuff that you can grab real quick, you gotta pack more of that. So that's like eggs, protein muffins, energy drinks. <laughs> we didn't run <laughs> out of energy. We didn't run out of energy No, drinks. but I packed three muffins a day for us because of macros, and that was gonna be our breakfast. But I think this is your fourth one, yeah, our fifth. So then I'm like, okay, that took away from tomorrow, and I ate an extra one. So now we have no. So now we know. So anyway, always just pack extra. The venue right here in Philly. If you didn't hear the first time, the venue's right around the corner. Rob's getting in the zone. He's in the back of the car getting, getting his mind right. And uh, I'm predicting another successful event. How fast are my arms tired? How do you hold this camera up that long? If they only saw how heavy this thing is. Change. That's what this is about. Changing. Not necessarily everything about us, but again, our behaviors, our habits, our thoughts, the way that we choose to interact with our day. These are the things that need to change. These are the things that will push us from this point to that point. So the event, uh a beautiful day just just ended the Philly event and it was another great event um, I just thought I'll take some of the principles that Rob speaks about and kind of apply it to fitness and, and, and something that you guys could use in your daily life and um, the, the purpose of one of the uh, I guess the taglines you could say for the event is to create a life that you don't need a vacation from right for me personally my biggest thing was I, I, needed, I needed to become healthy. I needed to change the way I thought. I needed to become more productive. I needed to learn to love myself more. Um, and it, it came down to a few things that Rob touched on today. Finding resolve, right? Actually finding practical things that you can implement in your life. Changing your habits, changing your daily routines. Actually, Making moves that's going to change the way your life looks. When we apply this to, to fitness, that is making exercise a priority, becoming better at making healthier eating choices, becoming better at keeping our promises to ourselves. Like these are all little practical things that we can work on on a daily basis that will lead up to big changes in our bodies and our lives in the long run. It's a process. It's a process that takes time and I, like I had a conversation with a few people at the event and I kind of spoke about you know again and if you watch the channel you're familiar with the way I, I think about this um, the way you mentally approach fitness like I, I met a few women that they like okay you know I, I, I go on my fitness journey I lose 10 or 15 pounds and then after that I fall off because that's what you that's why they started it was to lose 10 or 15 pounds it should be a lifelong thing 
You should be working out for the rest of your life. In some form, you should be taking care of your body. You should be eating healthy. Every day, you should be doing something to get you a little bit closer to the most optimal version of yourself, right? So, understanding that that's the goal, when you approach it with that being the goal, it changes, it changes things. Stop worrying about the skill. Stop worrying about what you look like. Let those be the icings on the cake as a result of you reforming your relationship with food, you changing your daily habits, you promising yourself to make exercise a daily part of your life, just like brushing your teeth is, or, or eating breakfast, or washing your face. We about to head up to New York. Um, as always, I'm just trying to share the wellness with you guys. So get well, and get money.